Hey folks, Gregory Cockery here in the Wildwood Lair with this glorious weapon paying homage, homage, I don't know what that word is, uh, paying respect to the mightiest of Steve Morse's. Uh, big fan of Steve Morse, Dixie Drags, one of my favorite bands of all doggone time. And uh, this guitar has a lot of stuff on it, reflecting, of course, the stylistic savagery that is Steve Morse. But let's kind of uncrack this code of all this stuff. It took me a minute to figure out what the heck was going on here. Uh, but let's just kind of go through it so you can hear what's happening. Uh, on that opening little salvo, I was just, just doing bridge pickup, which is this toggle switch all the way down, this switch up, and this switch down. So what happens here, folks, is that this main toggle switch here is bridge pickup. <laughs> This middle position of this toggle switch is just pick up all by itself. It's almost single coily sounding. And then in this extreme position of this toggle switch, it's this pickup right here. So then what this toggle switch does right here is it allows me in the uh, down position is to add the humbucker, the bridge humbucker, to any of the positions. So for instance, uh, with it down here, I'm doing this and this pickup together. Okay, in this position it goes, uh, bridge humbucker and neck humbucker. This toggle switch down here uh, engages this pickup right here. So the slanted single coilish pickup that's right next to the neck humbucker. So if I pop it up, it adds uh, this pickup to whatever I have this toggle switch on. So for instance, now I'm adding this to this because I'm in the down position, which is this bridge humbucker, adding this one in. Okay, if I go into this position, it's the neck humbucker with this pickup. Okay, now if I go to this position, it's these two pickups together. Okay. Now, in any of these scenarios, if I put this pickup down, it's adding this bridge humbucker into the scenario. So by popping this down, now I've got these three pickups going. Uh, in this situation, it's these three pickups. Okay. And that's how that goes. Now, if I pop this one all the way up, it just immediately goes to just this pickup. So it, it kills everything and it's just right there, okay? So a lot of stuff going on in this guitar, but it, it does make for uh, every kind of tonal option under the, the sun. This particular guitar is serial number G90570, weighing it at 7.3 pounds. Um, as I said, it kind of does it all. Just got to kind of figure out what's going on here. I do 
really dig the sound of this. This neck pickup's very squishy. Even though it is a humbucker, it's got kind of some single coil characteristics. With that pickup there, and you get kind of. Or add in that neck humbucker, or bridge humbucker. Or just go back to that bridge humbucker all by itself and get. Sounds awesome. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, Gregory Crockery here in the Wildwood Lair with the Steve Morse Blue Burst, Ernie Ball, Music Man, Steve Morse Signature Model, Wildwood Guitars, Gregory Cock. We'll see you later. <laughs>